You got this White Sox hat on. We are loving that for sure. We got to talk about the grand hustle because Chicago is a city that hustles for sure. And let's talk about the concept of the show and what it means to you. Uh, well, the show is basically a business competition show where we got the uh, 16 of the most uh, the most eligible hustlers to uh, compete for opportunity um, to to work alongside my team of executives on Grand Hustle and earn a six figure salary. Oh man, it sounds crazy. Are there any contestants from Chicago? Like this is a pretty big opportunity. I believe it was. I believe it was. I can't remember exactly who, but it that. Thursday uh, uh, at 10 p.m. on BET. I think y'all could tune in and find out. Well, we'll be tuned in. You know, Chicago has to root for us hometown. So tell me, what are some of the traits that you look for in the person who will win? Remember I told you I, we've enjoyed seeing your career blossom and you're a well-respected businessman on many fronts today. So what are you looking for in that next uh, successful person? For the most part, I think that tenacity is is a huge, huge uh, uh, deal for us. You, you have to be extremely passionate about uh, about uh, creating opportunities. Uh, that's that's what we do here. You know, we make a way out of no way, create opportunities where there are none, and uh, uh, and, and and basically blaze trails. Uh, but in being tenacious, you also have to have a certain level of accountability because if things don't go how you plan it, you know, you have to find ways to to create solutions instead of pointing the finger and passing the book. We know you just gave Mrs. Harris Tiny a beautiful gift, uh, a big expensive car, $225,000 car. Just tell me what it takes to make sure you still continue to grow as that family person, as a well-rounded person, not only in your business, but also at home. I mean, to be honest with you, I, I feel like whatever happens, uh, uh, within a relationship, I think that, you know, that's pretty much for the relationship, for, for the relationship of the people in the relationship. If you choose to share it, then I think what you share, you know, uh, should be observed and, and, you know, appreciated, and then it's time to move on to the next thing. I don't think that that's, gifts are nothing to dwell on, in my, in my opinion. I mean, over the years, we've, you know, we've both, done our share of gifting so you know I don't think this this time is uh, any more any more of a reason to acknowledge than the last time or the next time well T.I. thank you so much for your time we're a fan of the show we're a fan of the family and we're certainly wishing you the best and we're hoping for new music sometime soon thank you T.I. T.I. super cool there make sure you catch the grand hustle on BET on Thursdays at 9 p.m.